Tuesday was a hot day at the fair. We got up to 89 degrees, but it felt hotter at the fairgrounds because of what we call urban heat island effect. What that means is in urban location, the temperatures heat up hotter than the suburbs, and this is because the greenery helps to keep the air cooler. Also, other things in the urban locations add to the heat. Cars, buildings, factories, dark rooftops, which retain heat. Same for asphalt and concrete, which absorb a lot of that heat and just bump up our temperatures. It can get another 10, 15 degrees warmer than those suburb locations. And that's because the greenery in the suburbs adds to the cooling. We have a process called evapotranspiration. Any moisture on the greenery evaporates and helps to keep the air nice and cool. At the fairgrounds, lots of pavement, and that only adds to the heat in the air, but also the ground poses a threat. Because of the heat and also the sunshine, we have to have a sunny day. Say on Tuesday, when temperatures got close to 90, concrete can get up to 125, asphalt 140, which means skin can burn in seconds. So if elderly people or children are touching the ground or falling over, we could see some minor burns. Looking ahead, we have a couple of 80 degree days at the fair. Asphalt can still get up to 120 degrees. And on any slides or playground equipment, the heat and the friction from children going on those rides can also lead to skin burns. So something to keep in mind, you might wanna make sure your kids are fully clothed if they're going on those rides during the fair. The reason why asphalt gets so much hotter than grass is because of three things, albedo, Albedo is how dark something is, and asphalt is darker, absorbs more heat, it's more dense, and it has a lower heat, a higher heat capacity, which means it heats up higher. So this is why we're seeing hotter weather at the state fair as opposed to the suburbs. So keep that in mind if you're heading out to the fair, just a few days left. Reporting on the Weather Deck, I'm meteorologist Violet Skyberg. Back to you.